Minister Lynetta Jordan, and I am live tonight at the first annual Caregivers Awards, hosted and presented by the Kelly's Choice Foundation. We're here in Hampton, Virginia, and with me, I have a wonderful recipient of an award tonight. I want to introduce you to this great and beautiful honoree, and I'll let you tell everyone who you are. I'm just here gratefully and gracefully here to just receive this as appreciation of this morning. Yes, it is. And you know, you never can get enough appreciation on earth. Even in heaven, we'll yes. know the wonderful works we've done. But I, yes. you said something so important about children often finding themselves in positions where they have to support their parents now and switch roles. How was that for you? It was pretty much natural because I was a baby. Babies get spoiled. Yes. Babies get everything, and nobody can talk about the baby. And my baby, and my baby, and my mama don't like nobody don't like me. So we just might as well don't even start. No, we're my mama. And you take the children to talk about her baby because her baby is the beautiful thing in the world. Yes. So she because she tells me every day, thank you for just being here for me. And then oh, you know, that's beautiful because we know that we're the next father. Right. We know one day, no. by and by, when the morning comes, it's time to go and say hello to the Lord. But yet, in the process of us being here on, on earth, sometimes we don't know a person until they're sick. Wow. That's when you really know the person. Spending time when they're allowing you to do things, letting go and letting God, and you have to deal with the bathing and all these things, and people just have so much pride. Yes. But yet, when people let go and allow you into their heart, and into their space, and into their place where they're not, well, no one wants to be sick. Mm -hmm. Right, right. Most people like to be able to do for others. Right, right. So, that to me was natural. Okay, awesome. Because I am a mama's baby. You are mama's baby? Yeah, I'm not no daddy's baby because daddy was right there too. So, That's um, right. and I had to take care of my daddy and my sister, and I've just been a caretaker, just, just, just caregiver. And I care for you. If That's I pray for you. Yes. If that's what I do as ministry. That's what you do. It's a ministry. Yes, it is. Not too much. And it's not easy. Oh. It's, uh, I, I believe the caregiver is something that everybody cannot do well because everybody does not have the heart. Like, you demonstrate your heart to do that. Yes. You have to care. Yes. You, you have really, to care. You really demonstrate that. Yes. <laughs> thank you so very much for this opportunity. We thank you. I call her a purple princess tonight. Isn't she gorgeous? Well, well I want to give a shout out to Omega Side 5. Q R. I mean, I was the vice president of the Q Curls, the uh, court, you know, she states. So we just do this program. You just do the purple thing. That's the purple thing. <laughs> <laughs> we just do the purple thing. Okay. Again, okay. another wonderful recipient of the first annual Caregivers Awards from Kelly's Choice Foundation. I'm the motivator, Lynetta Jordan. God bless. Thank you. Kelly's choice. That's right. Kelly's choice. That's right. Kelly's choice. That's right. Kelly's choice. That's right. Now, on November the 14th, there's going to be a great award show that will be honoring and recognizing the work of caregivers. Well, because I'm a caregiver, not by choice, but by necessity. You see, neither one of us choose. To have to take care of anyone, but we are responsible. Because who wants to see someone sick? So, on 14th of November, in where? Hampton, Virginia, at the Messiah Center. What are we going to be doing? Honoring caregivers for their selfless love, their hearts, and sacrifices. Kelly's Choice. That's right. Kelly's Choice. That's right. November the 14th. Kelly's Choice. Meet us there. Meet us there. When are the tickets available? 
The tickets are available right now on our website, www.kellyschoicemail.com. The tickets are $35 until October the 15th, $45 thereafter. Looking for all kinds of things to take place. Nursing home visitations. Listen, Kelly's Choice has been, been around the state of Virginia. They're moving to North Carolina. They're moving all the way to New Jersey, into New York, and to other places. So, Virginia, if you don't get it now, you won't get it. You gotta care about somebody. Who cares? Kelly's Choice. Who cares? Kelly's Choice. See you there, November the 14th. After Virginia. One care. I thank God that it's going to be somebody who's going to have to care for me. And sometimes it's a great mystery who that person is going to be. That sounds like a rhyme, but I didn't care if it did or not. I just want to let you know that God is the one who's able to keep us from falling. May God bless you. May God continue to bless Kelly's choice as we come back next year and it gets bigger and bigger and bigger. And I love you, Kelly. God bless you.